Welcome back to the Michelle Valentine Show. I'm Michelle Valentine, and we have our special guests. We have Kent Foyer from Society Singles, and we have Sue Copening from OrlandoConnections.com, which used to be called Sue's The Net. So you'll go, oh, yeah, it was Sue's The Net. Yeah. Yeah. She's The Net. <laughs> she used to be The Net. Oh, okay. okay. So, but I have to say something before we really go to Kent, because in our discussion ahead of time, I liked that Kent said that you had this like mischievous look. Oh my God. You had this mischievous look about you. And I completely agreed. And he said that you had this twinkle in your eye. Yeah. Ken said he had a twinkle in his eye. I says, well, yeah, that's for all the uh, female viewers, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, I don't know. What can I say about a twinkle in my eye? All right. right. It's just that little thingy that. Okay. So I just talk amongst yourselves. Hello, Kent. Hello, Sue. <laughs> Hello. So we have you both on together. And how, so tell us what Society Singles is all about. Well, basically, we're just a kind of a social organization, very loose-knit. Uh, we don't have a board of directors or a president or a chair or, or a treasurer or anything like that. It's basically me. I started it three and a half years ago looking for somebody special in my life. Here it is three and a half years later, a mailing list of almost 5,000, 3,000 of them are ladies, and I'm, I'm so confused now, I don't think I'll ever find them. <laughs> <laughs> so, so I, but I keep on looking, and uh, one never knows I may get lucky, or, or some uh -huh. poor little damsel in distress will feel sorry for me uh -huh. and swoop me off my feet. What do so you think about that? What you're saying is that you started looking for that special someone, and in the process you have created this society group, this singles group? Well, you know, we're, we're not, when you, society may be kind of a misnomer in our case. Okay. We are professionals. Okay. But we're, we're educated people, and, but I don't think money is the, An is issue the thing all. that brings us all together. So we're single, we're friendly, we're sociable, uh, and, and we have school teachers, and we have secretaries, and, and para, uh, paralegals, as mm -hmm. well as bank presidents, and doctors, and lawyers, and a little bit of everything. So it's a good cross-section of Americana. And the age range is like 30s and up. So, so it's it, not a lot of young 20-year-olds or teenagers at the, these type of functions. They're held, what, it, I've been to a few of your functions, and they are beautiful, everyone. The functions are wonderful. There was the Dubs Red Country Club, and they were held at Contemporary Cars, and everyone gets all dialed up in sequin dresses, and the men are in suits, and there's not many functions going on like that where if someone really wants to get dolled up, they can go. So. Well, that's, that's very true, mm -hmm. in, in, especially mm -hmm. in Florida such a relaxed setting and everybody is you right. know is very casual right. whereas a requirement with us to just about to all of our events except some of our mm -hmm. really nice house parties mm -hmm. where you don't have to get so dressed up mm -hmm. but usually it's a coat and tie for the men a lot of times it's a black tie optional right. and generally cocktail or evening attire mm -hmm. for the ladies so That's it's a, it's a dress to impress mm -hmm. i always said it i think it's good it's always good I, at least i like it to have events where you can dress up and, and you know, just go in that type of atmosphere. Uh, mm -hmm. Orlando is a mm -hmm. city that is growing and, and we need all the, uh, this, is, this could mm -hmm. be uh, instituted as a, as a cultural mm -hmm. type of deal, you know, where, where people dress up nice, like going to the theater where you dress up really nice. Well, for instance, this is one of their invitations. They're very beautiful invitations. And uh, this one's, uh, these are coming up at the Dubs Dread Country Club. And they're sponsored by Jaguar, Collier Jaguar, and Dubs Red Country Club. And so even their invitations connotate a really, really beautiful event. Uh, they always have wonderful gourmet hors d'oeuvres, my favorite. They have a coffee and treat station when it gets later on in the evening. Oh, oh, and I know what else they have. I think they're grieving <laughs> out free hugs, everybody. <laughs> they're giving out free hugs. So I tell you, uh, this is um, something else because I, yes. they always charge for hugs. And in this case, do you charge for hugs? Well, they. I said they. Uh, I'm not saying they? I do. They always charge, not them. They. Don't ask me who they are. But they always charge <laughs> for hugs, and in this case, they don't. So it's a good thing. Make sure you go there for your free hug. Okay. All right. With that aside, please okay. continue. Let Besides me, the let hugs, let me, let me say Michelle, one thing about, <laughs> about this hug business so people don't think it's, it, we're getting a little bit too risque. And so uh -huh. We have a reception line, which is rather unique, and where men and women, when they come in, and, and they're, they're basically, a lot of them are, are, are lost, or they're walking wounded, or, or they're a little nervous, and, okay, and, and, okay. and by, by get, getting them through the reception line, where we offer these hugs, and they're not—they're real, not real demonstrative, you know, strong, 
uh, muscular type hugs. They're more just to make people feel good. And okay, we're, we're an icebreaker. But but they yeah. don't they don't have to. The handshake is good enough an introduction, mm -hmm. but they don't pass unnoticed at our event. That's very nice. Right. That's very it nice. is nice. You feel very comfortable. Uh, there's all kinds of things. You give away door prizes and valet parking. And uh, there's always some sort of, always some type of entertainment, like either a live band or you have DJ music. And, and I've always had a great time at their parties. So we just may attend one of these. And, yes, I and, think uh, we should show everyone out there what they look like. Yeah. So if you're interested in attending one of the Society Singles events, call the Society Single number, which is, let's see, what is it? Call the hotline number, which is 263 8736. And uh, call and find out more information about Society Singles. So stay tuned, and we'll be right back with Sue Copening and to find out just what does Sue and Kent do together in business here. Check out some of the taste of Winter Park. Yeah. A lot of women now prepare a dish that's complicated. It's complicated. <laughs> All right. Try to impress. Me, I like reservations. You're like... If you're enjoying the Michelle Valentine Show, you will love her new travel TV show, Love, Eat, Travel. Follow Michelle Valentine as she travels the world, showcasing the most beautiful destinations, unique adventures, romantic things to do, delicious foods, and more. Visit www.loveeattravel.tv for more information about her upcoming TV show. Hi, this is Michelle Valentine, and I would love if you followed me on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, Twitter, YouTube, and LinkedIn. Be sure to visit my website, michellevalentine.tv, for more information, read thousands of interesting blog posts, watch videos, enter sweepstakes, and more. Also, be sure to join my email list to receive my free weekly e-newsletter. Are you wondering where all the quality singles are? Singles that are attractive, educated, and financially secure? Hello, I'm Michelle Valentine, and I've helped thousands of singles live a happier life, and I can help you too. Clients and members include millionaires, models, doctors, lawyers, and teachers. So call us for your complimentary consultation. 